Ninja Forms offers a lot of settings and options for you to modify for your particular use case on your website. These can range from very general plugin settings to form settings to very specific field settings. And if you purchase extensions, they will also introduce various options to enhance your use of Ninja Forms. But let's just look at the plugin settings for now. If you go to your dashboard uh, and hover over the, the Forms icon, Ninja Forms icon, and click Plugin Settings, you'll see three tabs, General, Labels, and Licenses. General just offers you to add some basic formatting, your date format and your currency symbol, so that you can have that available. And there's also a Labels tab. Now, Labels tab lets you change some information that's output during the form processing, for instance, error messages, um, processing messages, if a field, if a whatever you want to say for required fields or if an e valid email address. You can type these all in right here and they will output uh, on the front end of your when you're using your form. And the final is a licenses tab. Now this is by default empty, but if you purchase any third-party extensions for Ninja Forms or our own extensions that we've developed from WPNinjas.com, they will generally come with a license key. By placing that license key here and saving it, you'll get automatic updates right in your dashboard. So you don't have to keep coming to the website and downloading a new copy every time it's updated. You can do it right from your dashboard, just like you would any other um, plug in from the WordPress repo like Ninja Forms itself. So you can get those automatic updates. So those are the basic plug in settings.